this is the 10,000 calorie cheat meal. What's going on guys, thanks so much and welcome to today's video. So as you see, today I'm gonna make something pretty epic, the 10,000 calorie cheat meal challenge. The rules are pretty simple, no liquid calories and you have to eat food that's worth 10,000 calories. Duh! So what I have here is one family size pizza, this is Italiano. And what I have here is ham, corn, cheese, mozzarella and uh, tomato sauce on top of a pizza base of course and this is one kilogram and 500 grams pizza and here I had to do this and made me a junk bowl this is junk bowl madness guys I'm gonna show you right now how I made it so check this out and let's begin with this cheat <laughs> If this is not epic, I don't know what to consider epic. I was going to do a lot, a lot more volume with the protein fluff because the base is protein fluff, but not like the ones that are low calorie because this is a really, really dense, really thick, really delicious protein fluff. And on top I have a ton of stuff. But I didn't add everything inside because I have it here on the side. I have the rest of the lion, three more pop tarts, one chocolate chip cookie dough, two. Uh, chocolate fudge, one is toasted, one untoasted, total of 180 grams of Oreo salted caramel and I have here four more apple pie Oreos because I'm gonna make a taste test with somebody you really want to see. So come here my brother. This story. <laughs> so we're gonna start with what do you want to start? We're gonna start with the Oreos or actually I want to say one big big thank you to Ron He's my soulmate from Canada Huge huge thank you to Ron for everything that he sent us So we're gonna taste test Oreo salted caramel Oreo apple pie Everybody's saying that they are like the most amazing pop tarts Pop tarts Oreos And here we have something that's for my collection of pop tart uh, boxes up there, you can see it. They can see them. Uh, or <laughs> Oreo chocolate fudge, and I'm pretty excited about that. And we're gonna taste test cream eggs. My brother has one here, and I have in my bowl. This is a tough decision. Yeah, it's a tough decision. Let's start with this broken Oreo because my brother only gives me broken stuff. A broken Oreo. At this moment, he knew he fucked up. Yeah. 
clean up the mess that you made. Okay, uh, he talks about the Oreo tins, the salted caramel. This is diet Oreo. The cookies smell like they are not just vanilla cookies. I don't know. I'm gonna try to twist it. Bro, they are broken because they are... You already ate, really. No. Because they are really thin. So let's give them a try. Out of 10? Yeah, out of 55? In an hour. Another one. And another one. Oh. They're really good actually. The cookie to cream ratio is really good. What are the people claiming the, the filling is made of? Like taste? Salted caramel. I don't taste the salt. By the way, this is part of the 10,000 cover challenge. One thing I noticed. After three months without taste tests, I don't know what caramel tastes like. Because this doesn't taste like caramel. No, it does taste like caramel. It just doesn't taste like, like salted caramel. 90% of the, the taste is from the biscuit. Whatever you say. How much you give it? Out of 10, not 55. <laughs> I was about to say 39. I don't know why, but 8. I'm gonna give them 7 out of 10 because you're good, but not, not my thing. Next, we're gonna try the apple pie. Oreos. Everybody is so hyped about them. Apple Oreos? Apple pie. Probably gonna hate it. Why? <laughs> I mean, so, I'm making with a lot of videos with you. I've thought on this channel yes. about a couple of times that I don't like apple pie. This is the front camera. I know it's, it won't focus, but this is the cream. It's like double stuffed actually. Okay. Not really. Hmm. It's definitely something different. You know what? I do like them. I do like them, but I'm gonna give them again. No, I'm gonna give them eight out of ten. I don't. Know, they're they're really good, but something I prefer over those the golden Oreos. Definitely. I do like one thing. The double stuffing. It's good to have more cream, but I don't like the cream. So how much do you give them? It must be less than the last one. So. My brother is speaking so so quiet. It must be less than the last ones I graded, so I don't know why. I don't like the cream. 6.5. Sorry, Masen. Moving on, we're gonna try now the Pop Tarts. So, first is going to be untoasted Pop Tart. I have a package, a big one. Oh, yeah. Guys, you know my love about. Pop tarts, just if, if they were a bit less carbs, but I'm all about the carbs. So just if they sold them here in Bulgaria, um, I think this is the bigger problem. They actually sell them, but it's like triple the price you pay there. They do sell them here, online. Oh, online. chocolate fudge pop tarts. Cheers. <laughs> They're so gonna be better toasted. Untoasted, not one of my favorites. So. Let's move to the toasted part. Like my brother said, M Ching is gonna be way, way better. <clears throat> toasted Pop Tarts. Cheers. Mm. It's so much better, but still, I don't think they are one of my favorites. Do, do you know what this tastes like? Cookies a kuska, yes? Mm. You know, the ice cream we eat each summer called Galaxy. No, no. But, but not the ice cream? No. But the cone? No. But the dark one? No. With some sugar on it? Mm, no. And... And as my brother just said, it's, uh, it's good, but it's not that good. In my opinion. It's good, but it's not as good as I wish it was. My favorites are confetti, confetti cupcake and chocolate chip cookie dough, which I'm gonna have a bit later. Look, it's pop tart. I love it. I'm gonna give it 8.5, but it's definitely not in my top three. So, since I cannot remember the taste of any other pop tart because it was like ages ago, I'm gonna I'm gonna rate it compared to the Oreos. Not baked, seven. Baked, seven. The cream eggs, Cadbury cream eggs. Cadbury chocolate is amazing, and a birdie. Let's give it a try. Oh yeah. 
it's a really sweet chocolate and besides it has even more sweetness but because of this white and um, orange cream it's mine, deadly delicious mine was pink pink yeah let's see this is kinder surprise surprise how do you say it in english surprise and this is cadbury cream egg. cream egg yes a truly cream egg what a troll a true i get rid of it mm -hmm. the chocolate was really good but i i don't like the filling not really so devastating okay thank you this was my brother it was so exciting to have him today in my video now you can go finish your plate and have your pizza because my brother has a pizza too now yeah you can go you can you can go <laughs> And for the ending, I'm gonna be so not trendy and I'm gonna do a fucking dab. Definitely one of the most exciting tastes we have to go. Before I start with the pizza, I'm gonna have some sweets because I think later I'm not gonna be able to. With all this, I'm gonna have some special Coke store brands. This is a 10,000 calorie in one sitting challenge. Let's do this. Just so we know the starting time. But I will not get down. For you can't force me now. Awakening is clear. I could show you how. I could show you how. So I said, guys, this will be my last cheat for a for a very long time. Because from now on, I'm gonna start my lean bulk. I don't wanna make cheats that I have to starve, basically starve a few days just so I don't gain weight from. And this year I'm gonna bulk for a long time. I really want to do it slow. And my goal is to finish with a six pack. As I say, the 25,000 car challenge didn't happen because I just basically didn't get 650 likes but guys I don't care about this challenge I didn't want to do it at the first place I just did it so basically more people watch this video but um, yeah if you did hit the 650 likes I would have done it but this challenge would have brought me back like a few steps back because I'm gonna gain a lot of weight and it's mainly going to be just fat I started to make something like a lot of cheese and this here is a meal out of this world nobody should eat this much calories in one sitting I don't even know if I have the capacity to eat it that's why I'm doing it so pop tarts done, Oreos done those are cream eggs biscuits Delicious. I'm gonna have some of the jungle and I'm gonna bring you closer. Actually, you know what? I kept here white fudge covered Oreos. So, never had them, let's give them a try. Now this, this is a 9.5 out of 10. As you see, I divided everything in different sections here. We have white chocolate M&M's, I haven't tried those two. So I'm gonna give it a try. Really, really good. So we have M&M's, white Kit Kat. White Lion, White Snickers, Cream Egg Biscuits, and Reese's White Chocolate, Oreos, a lot of them. And the protein fluff is amazing.
one bite with everything. <laughs> Okay, gonna leave that to the side for now and I'm gonna attack the pizza and the neat mustard which is almost over yay Change the front camera. The only downside is that it's not hot anymore. It's not hot, but it's delicious. Mmm, mustard. Some of you say that, hey, Ilian, I don't want to watch my protein taste tests and, and videos like that. We want to see you do epic cheats. Well, so I can tell that from now on, I'm not gonna make cheats like this. At least in the near future, because. As said, this brings me a lot of steps back. I gain weight. I have to under eat for a few days to balance out my calories. And it's freaking expensive, my friends. Unless you want to pay me to do them, I'm not about that life. This is like my last treat meal until the book. And I don't think I'm gonna crave any food during this book. During this bulking period, I'm gonna have high calorie days on my training days and low calorie days on my rest days, which means that I'm gonna have like probably when I'm deep in my bulk, like four, five thousand, five thousand like, a bit extreme, but maybe four thousand calorie days of eating. So bulking days, I'm gonna start my bulking series. I'm gonna have a lot of cooking videos. I have a lot of recipes to show you guys, and I have a recipe for a pizza base that has only I think it was 600 calories for a whole pizza like maybe two thirds of this pizza mm -hmm. maybe a bit less I don't know the mustard is almost over shit Now, <sighs> now this will be difficult. This was good though. It will be delicious, but so 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 crazy sweet. In this bowl, only in this bowl, I think it's close to 600 grams of sugar. Yay!
This was so sweet. Woo. Really delicious though. This was the 10,000 calorie cheat meal. Hope you enjoyed it guys. If you did, make sure to give a like, comment down below and subscribe to the channel. See you in my next one.